In today's video, I want to share with you a powerful concept that can help you change your daily actions, habits, and behavior to transform your life and bring you closer to achieving the success you desire. It's called behavioral congruence, or simply put, aligning your behavior, which is the sum of your thoughts, emotions, daily actions, and habits with your life's goal, mission, and purpose. It's about embodying the person you want to become and taking consistent action that reflects the desired state in your life. Dan Kennedy puts it really well. Act like the person you want to become and soon enough, you will be that person. This concept of behavioral congruence and training your behavior highlights the importance of bridging the gap between wanting to become someone and actually being that person every day. To better understand this idea, let's take the example of someone who aspires to become an elite athlete in any sport. They can't just watch other elite athletes and wish to become like them. The ones that truly become elite athletes align their behavior with the best athletes in the world. They train every day. They study and learn from watching other best athletes in the world. They hire the best coaches and train with them. And they eat the right foods and prioritize their recovery and sleep. Not just one day, but every single day. So if someone aspires to be an elite athlete, they need to incorporate every element and every aspect of an elite athlete's life into their own. And that's when they will go from wishing to become an elite athlete to actually being one in the present moment. So how can you apply this concept of behavioral congruence to achieve the success you desire in your life? One powerful approach that I can suggest to you is CBT. It's called Cognitive Behavioral Training. If you don't know, CBT is a form of psychological retraining of your mind to identify negative thought patterns, bad habits and behavior and replace them with positive thought patterns and better habits for positive outcomes in life. And personally, I like to use this technique every single day when I'm writing to train my mind and program it for positive thoughts I want to think, actions I want to perform daily, success habits I want to install in my life, and poor habits that I want to get rid of. And I use this technique to align myself with my big goals, the milestones, and the things that I'm wanting to achieve in life, be it in health, wealth, or relationships. This daily practice that I'm suggesting to you operates on the principle that your thoughts, emotions, and behavior are interconnected. And by modifying your thought patterns, you can actually influence your emotions, your daily actions, and habits in life to achieve positive outcomes that you desire. And you can train your own behavior consistently with a daily journaling and writing practice. Every morning for 15 to 30 minutes, find a place, be it your desk, your couch, or somewhere where you can be left alone with your thoughts and something that you can use to write with. And then begin to write freely and allow your thoughts to flow. Write about your big milestones and the goals you want to achieve in the next six months or one year. Write about your thoughts, your feelings, and your beliefs. Write about your current daily actions and things you perform every day in life and compare these things to the ideal self you want to become and the ideal life you want to live. Then identify the gaps between your ideal self, your ideal life, and the person you are currently and the life you are living currently as well. And then write about and reinforce positive thoughts, empowering beliefs, and the good habits you want to follow every day that will help you accomplish your goals. Create a daily plan of action for yourself. Imagine your goals, what you need to do in the next month, in the next three months, in the next six months and year, the things that you need to do that will help you move closer to the goals that you have set for yourself. This practice will help you you in transforming your self-image and will affect your personality by aligning your behavior with your goals, mission, and purpose. For example, if you want to lose 15 pounds, shed fat, and build muscle, you might be struggling because maybe you are in a bad habit of eating ice cream or junk food at night before going to bed. Or you might not be in a habit to exercise consistently. I used to be there as well. But once I identified the things that healthy people do, the people that I used to watch at the gym who were really athletic, were lean, I started to figure out the things that they do 
do personally in their lives, their habits, their actions, the kind of food they eat. And I actually started journaling and writing about those things and wanting to do that in my own life. And the more I wrote about those things and the more I aligned myself with the kind of person I wanted to become who would shed those 15 pounds to become athletic, those things actually started to happen. And when I would reflect every day on my goals and where I was, I would identify the gaps and the things that I was not really doing to achieve my goals. And this practice of writing down things that I wanted to achieve and the things, the actions that I would take daily that could help me achieve these goals, helped me identify how far away I was from my goals, the kind of habits that I was not following or the ones that I should get rid of. Like in, in the example that I was talking about eating ice cream and unhealthy snacks before night, I started to program myself that instead of eating ice cream, maybe I should eat a protein bar instead. And that way I could curb my sweet tooth, but also eat something nutritious that would provide me the protein to recover from my workouts and things like that. Let's take another example. Let's say you want to become a software developer in the next six months or one year. For that, you will have to learn how to code, install a practice of actually sitting down, building projects and writing code for that project. You will also have to manage your fears, self-doubts and the negative emotions you feel when you face a new challenge that you are not really ready for yet. And that's where a journaling practice and training your behavior comes in place, where every single day for 15 to 30 minutes, just sit down, think to yourself, what are the things that you're struggling with? Write about your aspirations that you want to become a software developer in the next six months, the things that you could do to achieve that goal, the kind of projects that you want to work on every single day and write code for to help you achieve the goal of becoming a good software developer. And in this practice, you can identify your negative self-talk that is going on through your head, the things that I felt in my career before actually getting good at things, things like I'm not good enough, I can't code, or this is too hard. I would address these negative self-talk when I was writing every day and actually training my mind and installing the beliefs that I needed in my life to trust myself more and have more faith in myself that I could become the software developer that I want to in the next six months or a year. And you could use the same thing not just in this specific example, but for any endeavor in life that you're pursuing, any career goals, any health goals, and even any relationship goals. Just get into a practice of writing and planning out your life every day. And slowly, those things will become a reality as you take action on those things, reflect upon what's going on, reflect upon your thoughts and emotions and actions and things like that. As James Clear in his book, Atomic Habits says, the the most effective way to change your habits is to focus not on what you want to achieve, but on who you wish to become. And I personally believe that the sum of what you think, your experiences, your daily actions and habits form your overall personality and behavior. And if you slowly begin to write about these things and train your behavior consciously, you can begin to change your life and transform it completely to align yourself with the kind of person you want to become and the kind of life you want to live and create for yourself. So here's some actionable advice for you. If you struggle to change your behavior and align your actions and habits to achieve success in life, there could be many challenges like you might not even know the kind of life you want for yourself right now. You could be struggling imagining the kind of person you want to become. Or if you have no idea what kind of mindset, what kind of daily actions and habits you should install in life to achieve the success you desire. Do the following things. Number one, model your life after successful individuals who have achieved what you aspire to accomplish in your life. Learn from their habits, their mindset, their decision making processes and the things that they do in their life that enables them to be successful at whatever they are good at. Number two, take some time out every single day, either 50 to 30 minutes in the morning or before going to bed and just write freely about the person you want to become. Identify this person's way of thinking, their daily actions and habits, their behavior and attitude. Also identify any self-limiting beliefs, negative thoughts or actions that might be hindering you 
from actually becoming this person that you envision or imagine and then work on rewiring those negative thought patterns and replace your negative self-talk with positive ones identify the habits you want to get rid of and replace them with new ones that could actually be useful on your path to achieve your goals number three practice and repeat habits of success consistently until they become embedded in your new self-image and become a part of your new personality understand that your journey towards transforming your behavior will be challenging at first you will face mental strain and discomfort and often fall off track and get stuck in your old ways of doing things but if you persist and remain disciplined, you will adapt to your challenges and grow stronger by developing a new sense of self with the behavior that is aligned with your life's goals, mission, and purpose. Remember, to achieve success, you will have to do hard things. Things that might seem impossible to you today, but those same things that seem impossible to you today could be your new normal in the future. As long as you can make your behavior congruent with the person that can achieve these hard goals, do these hard things, and consistently take action on them to achieve the milestones and the goals you set for yourself. So stop running yourself on autopilot for an easy life full of distractions and comfort. Instead, make the conscious choice of training your behavior every day to become your ideal self and ensure that your daily actions and habits are congruent with your life's plan. And that's how you will align your behavior with the person you want to become to create the life you desire for yourself. So guys, I hope you found this video useful. As always, I'm rooting for you and I wish you all the best. Go be that person you want to become and create your ideal life. Like, share and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next video.